and welcome back. Elisa Tam is a junior at Fishers High School. While the school's on spring break, she has been hard at work wrapping up a service project that went above and beyond even her own wildest expectations. Our Jason Fechner has this story. I want to be somewhere in the medical field. I don't know exactly what, but I know I want to help people. Lofty long-term ambitions for Fisher's high school junior Elisa Tam, who's already helping people thanks to a book drive she started last month. It started out as two box in the kitchen. And now... Right here, it's 5,482 books. In two weeks. In two weeks. We have all types of books, from textbooks to nonfiction books to, you know, uh, science books. We have it all. Tam reached out to family, friends, and several other schools to make it happen. English teacher and Jefferson Award Students in Action advisor Eduardo Torres wasn't necessarily surprised by the teen's success. If you're a great educator, and you don't have to be a teacher, but if you can mentor someone and, and let them follow what they're passionate about and just stand out of the way and be a safety net for them, you will be continually surprised at what they can do. Um, and I'm always impressed with, with what my kids are, are capable of. As for all those boxes and boxes of books now. When we're done filming, we're going to have you take a couple, put them in the car. <laughs> They're all headed to become part of someone else's story as Elisa prepares for whatever chapter comes next. I plan to reallocate these back to veterans and students locally, and we're also exploring the option of sending them overseas as well. In Fisher's Jason Fechner, RTV6. Tam's project is entered in the Jefferson Awards Students in Action competition featuring projects from area high schools across central Indiana. We'll take you to the awards ceremony next Wednesday on RTV6.